What is up guys, my name is Golden Badger, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be talking about the horses in Red Dead 2 but before we do guys, make sure to leave a like on the video if you find yourself enjoying at any point, subscribe if you're new to the channel and want to see more, or comment down below if you want to suggest any new ideas for me, or if you just want to play with me in online. That being said, let's jump today in today's video. So in today's video we're going to be talking about our very first episode of the horse re horse reviews in Red Dead Online and the very first horse that we're going to be coming across in online is going to be the Scrawny Neck. Now the Scrawny Neck, just like it sounds, is the worst horse you get in the game. And it's also the very first horse you get, like I said. Um, you get this horse immediately when you start off before you can even ride any other horse. This is the one you get. It has absolutely the worst stats in the game. It's the ugliest horse. It looks skinny and frail and if you if you have to go long distances i mean god bless you because it's gonna take a while but that being said it also has kind of something good about it because it has a special trait when you're later in the game and you're a higher level and you have other horse or horses if every other horse that you have is downed or just your horse in general is down and dead and whatever if you call for a horse scrawny nag will show up so it's the it's the most ugly silly horse you can get but it will always be there for you because every time you're in a pickle and you call for your horse and it, it won't come this one will so it's nice to have a little backup horse like this i think rockstar did a good job of, of giving you guys a a, a backup a backup horse like this granted it's not the best one in the game it's not even a good one it's not even a decent one but it is there which is nice to have i mean i sh i certainly appreciate not having to run all the way to valentine if i if my horse dies in the heartlands now let me know in the comments what your opinion is on this horse and what your favorite horse breed is and i also want to give you guys a little heads up rockstar games has like i said in two or three videos before this one they have a feedback page on their website which is it's very good i i spent a lot of time there to suggest new ideas for the game if you guys have new ideas for horse breeds or even coat variants for horses um, go to their website the link will be in the description below go to their website suggest new horses new variants or any any uh, anything else that you think could change in the game or you want you want to see added um yeah just just go there and uh make sure to let them know so thank you guys for watching i hope you found it informative and enjoyable today if you did leave a like show me some love subscribe if you're new to the channel and comment down below if you want to talk to me or play with me like i said so thank you so much for your time have an awesome day and i'll see you guys in the next one